Multiple fights broke out at Canutillo High School yesterday, and today the district responded to parental and community concerns. CBS 4 at 530's Jennifer Cuevas tells us how the district is addressing the fights and parents' reaction. I feel like uh, there's something else going on behind the scenes because it seemed very organized, especially for that amount of fights to be happening. Parents of Canutillo High School say they are worried about the growing number of fights happening at their children's school campus. I feel sad for the boys and girls fighting. Um, they shouldn't be doing this and, and I also feel uh, scared that it can happen to my daughter or my son. Gustavo Reveles, the spokesperson for Canutillo ISD, says a total of six fights happened yesterday all at different times on campus, with the majority involving freshman students. Uh, they, uh, that was abnormal in the terms of the number of fights that we saw. He says the district's police department was the one who responded to yesterday's fights with the help of some El Paso police officers. Reveles adds, today, principals and assistant principals have been in the hallways to keep an extra eye on students in addition to the teachers. The teachers are... are also uh, making sure that students are, are following the rules uh, and intervening. So that's, that's uh, an additional layer of response for us as well. This video shared on Instagram quickly shows a teacher trying to break up one of the two fights going on before the teacher eventually falls in with the students. Do you have a response in terms of teachers stepping in to maybe some of them coming out injured themselves from stopping these fights? We, we work with teachers to make sure that they're aware of how to intervene, how to stay safe, and, and what to do in those cases. Javel has added the district is calling on parental support to inform their children about the consequences they may face in and out of schools. It does a lot fall on the parents because the parents aren't disciplining their kids like they should be. It starts at, uh, at the house for sure too, right? But um, mm, it should be equal.